How are you? I'm great. How are you guys doing? You guys are cold, huh? Tell us, <laughs> tell us, take us through it. Uh, just day to day, honestly. I mean, I'm waiting for what the doctor's telling me to do. Um, just going in there, seeing what they have me doing every day, and you know, trying to do whatever I can to get back as soon as I can. What was the procedure? Uh, just my procedure. Um, nothing crazy, but you know, one thing I could say is I, w I will be back, and but the thing is when, and uh, so I'm trying to do whatever I can every day. Do you have a time frame in mind? I don't. I mean, the doctors do, but um, I'm just trying to do whatever I can to get back and get able to play. Ronis, how, diff how difficult is it because you're a senior uh -huh. that you win the season like this and you can't you can't get out there? I mean, the season's not over for me, and it's not over for the team. Um, yeah, it's. I mean. You could count me out for this game, but um, I'm doing whatever I can to get back you know, as soon as I can. Uh, but you know, not being able to play, you know, senior night stuff like that. Um, uh, you know, I had a lot of great memories in Austin, and you know, it's you know, it's still this Saturday, still be another great memory for me, and you know, the entire season is. Ronis, how is your analysis of how Doug Brand is coming? <clears throat> uh, he's doing a great job. Um, you know, the entire line is stepping up big time this week. You know, communication-wise, uh, you know, Hamani's also doing a great job, and Jake Fisher. Uh, and all of them, you know, they got to work together. But even when I was in there, they all did a great job communicating. So nothing's really changing besides, um, you know, having my experience in there. But you know, Doug and Hamani, they're doing a great job. Can you take us through the play where you got injured? Uh, yeah, I was just, you know, trying to make a block, and you know, just Cleve got caught in the turf, and um, you know, just that's what happened. Really, that's all I could could really say that happened. And that's, you know, that's all that happened. But. Uh, it's just unfortunate, but you know, it's a sport, you know, things happen. Uh, you know, I've been liking being able to go through my career here with nothing really serious, and this isn't something serious, but you know, I'll just, I'll be back as soon as I can. Can you tell me about the seniors here? I know you're not going to get to play on Saturday, but you're going to be part of that part of the ceremony. What it's been to be here with all this group? Yeah, it's been an honor. It's been a pleasure. You know, it's um, like today we got done practicing. It's, you know, it should be an honor to go to practice with these guys, and it is. And, uh, you know, had a lot of great memories in Austin, a lot of great memories from my whole career here. But, you know, it's, it's, it's not over, I promise. And I'll, I'll be back wearing a, a duck uniform. So there is a chance you could play in the Civil War? Uh, day to day. <laughs> <laughs> For us, did, you, did you think it was serious when it first happened? No, I mean, it's not serious. It's not. It's, you, know, I'm, <laughs> you know, think about Farrell. I'm very thankful, you know, what happened to Farrell. That's crazy. Uh, so I think about him every day. Um, so that's that's something that's serious to me. This isn't serious at all to me. You know, I still, I'm going to be back playing you know, for Oregon. <laughs> uh, it's going to be really soon. Uh, I just can't tell you when. Uh, all I could say is, I'm, you know, getting, doing whatever I can every single day to, to get back out there. If you could say something to Farrah, have you spoken to him at all? Uh, I haven't. I mean, he's he's still he's in Cleveland with his family. Uh, I don't really want to bother him at all. And uh, but you know, I mean, I'm gonna contact him soon when he's ready. Uh, he's he's doing good though. He's doing good. We're doing sort of a video get well card. Okay. I uh, love you, man. You know, get better. Uh, stuff seeing you go down, and you know, praying for you. I, I assume uh, Saturday was still going to be pretty special because it's senior night and you have a chance to spend the time with the other seniors and with the coaches. How special is that actually going to be for you to be out there and at least participate that way? Uh, it's, you know, anytime you get to run down Austin, it's special. Well, you know, being able to go down that tunnel one last time is, you know, it's going to be something very special. Um, and all I could just do is enjoy the, enjoy the day and you know, just focus on the game, doing whatever I can to help the guys, you know, go and get get them going, you know, doing whatever I can to to um, be a part of the game and, you know, help them win. you have a favorite memory? Uh, every, every single game is a favorite memory for me. You know, um, you know, just being around these guys every single day, you know, walking through the building, you know, going to, to, to lifting, you know, being in a treatment center, you know, everything here has been, you know, a special ride. You know, very, very uh, thankful for it. AJ, do you think this will be Marcus's last home game? I mean, I, I mean, <laughs> he just enjoyed the day. Uh, I really don't know. I, I've even, you know, asked him. You know, that's not. Uh, I'm not in a position to be able to comment on that. You know, but he's. Yeah, I think he'll be able to comment on that. But I have no idea.